What's up, Youngstown? Welcome to this week's episode of Light the Wick. I am Brandon Trelecki. This week, we'll be looking at Catholic Charities and the premiere of Tessa's Vegan Ventures. Let's do it. On this week's episode, I sat down with Terry Vickers, case manager for Catholic Charities in Youngstown, and learned about the emotional toll that working with local families who have become homeless can really take on him. Let's take a look. Catholic Charities is a social service agency that provides uh, support and services for primarily low-income individuals, many of whom are the working poor, uh, some of whom are disabled. Uh, we work with the elderly. Uh, we work with families in a number of different situations. My name is Terry Vickers. I am a case manager at Catholic Charities Regional Agency. I had already mentioned that I spend a lot of time with single moms with their, their kids. Uh, but there are also plenty of homeless who are uh, single males, who are elderly, who are disabled. There is a lot of diversity among the clients I work with. Some of the, some of the things I see over and over again are disabled people trying to maintain an apartment and live on $770 a month because that's the average right now. And think about that, that's daunting. It's easy to stay passionate because you just meet people in daunting circumstances who are oftentimes extraordinary people. Now we transition into something we all love, and that's food. Food is something we are all passionate about. Yes, you have love, art, nature. However, food is different. Our beloved Tessa and Katie headed to Mission Taco to get a little taste of what being vegan is really like. Let's take a look at what went down on that day at Mission Taco. I'm Tessa from Light the Wick, and today I'm starting a new little series called Vegan Ventures, where I'm going to check out different restaurants in the Youngstown area and see what options they have for vegans. Now, I'm a vegan, but I thought to make it more interesting, I would bring friends along with me that are not vegan and have them try the food with me. So today I have Katie here with me. Hello. Also from Light the Wick. And we're here at Mission Taco. We're gonna try some vegan tacos. And how are you feeling about trying vegan food? I am not like a big eater whatsoever, so I'm down to try anything. Awesome. Okay, well let's go get some tacos. <laughs> So we ordered cauliflower tacos with black beans, cilantro lime rice, extra cilantro, guacamole, and some pico. Mission Taco for vegan food was a success. In fact, Mission Taco uses GMO-free food and local food as much as possible. Check out Mission Taco on Boardman Canfield Road. That'll do it for this week's episode of Light the Wick. Make sure to hit that subscribe button as hard as you can and follow us on our social media accounts. 
and always make sure to use hashtag the wick is lit. I am Brandon Terlecki. Have a wonderful rest of your week.